Hey y'all, welcome back to our channel. Welcome if you're new. I am Stephanie and you're watching Stephanie Case Farm Family. We are in the vehicle right now on our way home from our shopping trip. I have my three girls with me. I don't know if you can see all of them. Shawler's over there in the passenger seat and then I got the two younger ones in the back. Hope you can hear me. Um, we have been to a western store that is in uh, the state next to us looking for a birthday present for my husband. Um, then we went, where did we go next? We went to Walmart. So I got a little bit of a Walmart haul for you. And well, it was a big Walmart haul. It was 300 something dollars, which we got. Um, they needed a little bit of some fall clothes, some winter clothes, kind of trying to get a little stocked up here and there. And just, we got a bunch of random stuff at Walmart. And then we went to the Dollar Tree. We ate at Zaxby's. That's our favorite place to eat me and the girls. Kayden can't eat there because I think they cook in peanut oil. And then we went to Aldi. So I have a Walmart haul, a Dollar Tree haul, and um, an Aldi haul for you. And I do have a meal plan I will share with you for the next week. We do, we are a family of six if you're new here. We do eat breakfast, lunch, and supper at home most of the time, 99% of the time. We very rarely go out to eat. We have snacks, desserts, all that planned out for us for the week. Sometimes I cook it and sometimes I don't. It just depends on what kind of mood I'm in, I guess. But anyway, I will see y'all when we get home for our grocery haul, Walmart haul, or our Aldi haul, Walmart haul, and Dollar Tree haul. Okay, y'all, we are back home and I'm sweating. Got everything unloaded. Got a whole table full of stuff. I'm going to turn it around and show you all my Aldi haul first because I've got some cold stuff that needs to be put away. So here we go with the Aldi haul. Alright, I'm going to start on this end of the table. I got two gallons of whole milk, a thing of buttermilk, my caramel macchiato coffee creamer. I will have to quit rattling bags back there. <laughs> Um, two things of sour cream. I got a thing of chicken breast and a thing of honey uncured ham for our lunch meat this week. Uh, we had to have a snack on the way home, so we got these chocolate crunch bars. I like the strawberry ones better. I don't care much for the chocolate ones. But anyway, it was a quick snack. I got two things of a bacon, a thing of the crispy chicken strips, and then just another bag of the frozen chicken breasts, boneless chicken breasts. Um, a big pack of the uh, Happy Farm Single American Cheese, two things of pork sausage, and a lot of this stuff that y'all see, I forgot to tell y'all, I'm just restocking my pantry and getting ready for winter time, so that way if we get sick, I can just pull out of my stash that I have. We have been using some of our stash, so I'm trying to restock a little bit at a time. I got four things of cream cheese. Cream cheese freezes very well, so... Uh, that's what I'm going to do with those. They're going to go in the freezer. And then some uncured beef franks. A loaf of honey wheat bread. A thing of hot dog buns. Some Hawaiian sweet rolls. I got my mat flying around here. Two packages of flour tortillas. I got two things of strawberries. They weren't on sale this week, but they weren't ridiculously high. So I went ahead and got those. We got some more kiwis. The, the girls love kiwi. I got a bunch of bananas, a big 10 pound bag of potatoes. And then this is some restock. It's just some um, pasta sauce. And then I got this pasta sauce too. I tried to get two different kinds. This is more restock. All the canned stuff is like restock stuff. I got six things of sweet peas. The girls love those. Uh, Four things of cream of chicken soup. I was going to get some more cream of mushroom, but they didn't have any. So, they didn't have any of the name brand either. So, I had to just get what I could get today. A thing of hot dog chili, or we use it for hot dog chili. And Paisley wanted some of the, she called them, the beans that are sweet. So, baked beans. I got a country style baked bean, and then a maple and cured bacon baked beans. Um, a big package of pepperonis for the thick sliced pepperoni uh four bags of powdered sugar yeah four bags two bags of the brown sugar we've been using 
a lot of next. We've had a lot of birthdays here lately, so got that. This is a restock of pinto beans. And then I got a chicken broth. That's a restock. Beef broth is a restock. Uh, two things of ranch dressing. Two things of Thousand Island. And then their barbecue sauce. I got three things of it. This barbecue sauce is awesome. Y'all need to try it from Aldi. And then I got just the big bag of the snack combo potato chips. They don't seem to waste them as bad if they're in the little bags. So, got those. And then I was out of the powdered ranch that I usually get from Sam's. And I forgot to reorder it when I did my Sam's order. So, I just got four packages of ranch mix. Let's see. I got one thing of chewy chocolate chips for church for my kids on Sunday because I do a Sunday school class. And then I got one for here at home. And I got one, two, three, four, five things of milk chocolate chips. They go through those a lot. The kids put them in ice cream. They just eat them. Um, and then cookies and whatever else too. Two things of devil's food cake mix. And then a thing of the cinnamon graham crackers. And then a thing of salting crackers. That's just a restock. And then Paisley picked these peanut butter fudge cookies out. And then I got three of the classic white cake mixes to put back in my stockpile. They had one box of the fruit and grain bars. Their fruit and grain bars are the best to me. I mean, we like these better than the name brand. So, they have one box. So, we got them. And then this is just a restock or just to stock my pantry. A thing of rolled quick cook oats. And then... I haven't seen these before. The baked turtles, cheddar turtles. So we got a thing of those. And then just some bathroom cleaner that has bleach in it. So I can just be busy cleaning bathrooms. And I don't think I missed anything. So that is all we got from Aldi. And it was like, I think it was $204 and some change. Things have gone up, but it's still a whole lot cheaper than other places. <laughs> so that's what we got from Aldi. Now I'm going to move on to my Walmart haul. All right, y'all, here is my Walmart haul. And y'all just have to pay no attention. We just threw the bags all in the floor back here. I needed some more bleach, so I got a thing of bleach. My husband needed some more body spray, so I got him this body spray. Uh, I'm afraid that the dogs are gonna bring cat or fleas into the cat, so I got them some flea and tick shampoo to give them a bath in to keep the ticks away from, or ticks and fleas, I cannot even talk away from the cats uh sage picked up a bath bomb i will probably use that tonight i needed some more hairspray so i got my favorite hairspray shawler needed some mousse but uh, the mousse was extremely expensive so she got this curl foam uh this is a restock for my closet for the men i got them two things of deodorant this is their favorite deodorant um the girls Picked, or I picked this um, polish out for fingernails and toenails. Um, I just got this to restock my deodorant. And then it's like when I open one, I go buy another. Shawler picked this deodorant out because she's almost out of her other one already. Here is her toothpaste that she has to use because her teeth are super sensitive. Uh, Sage has a fish tank now. And she has some little fish in it. So we needed oh, okay. a new filter thing to uh, filter the water. So I just got her a replaceable filter cartridge to go with it. I hope that one fits. I got the medium one. So I'm hoping that works. And she just got some <laughs> more. I just threw it. Some um, fish food. Can't think. Cannot think today. Um, I only have one fish. Well, you'll be getting some more. Daddy's going to carry you and get some more. Uh, we do have a rodeo coming up. So, I just got these drinks for the kids, for the cooler, for the rodeo. And my husband and my son, um, they drink these liquid IVs. So, I got them a strawberry one to try this time. They've tried the watermelon, pina colada, and there was another one. But they didn't like the other one. They said it tasted like sweat. So, I got them the strawberry to try. They like the watermelon and the pina colada, so I'm thinking and hoping they will like the strawberry. Uh, we went through the $5 movie section. So, we come home with the Chronicles of Narnia, the Lion, the Witch, and the Wardrobe, the Crudes, and then this is not the $5 one. My husband, we don't have Dish Network anymore. So, uh, he had all of these, the monsters. Well, the dog keeps barking. 
the Monsters um, DVD or the movies <laughs> DVR and we don't have it anymore but we do have a DVD player and his birthday's coming up so got this for his birthday if you work with him or you know him do not tell him his birthday present that's one of his birthday presents so I just got him the season one and season two of that uh, Paisley wanted some more room spray so she picked out pumpkin spice room spray they're getting in the fall spirit we're gonna do some fall decorating not long from now and my girls love fake nails and they want me to wear fake nails <laughs> so I got some uh, nail bond and glue they picked these nails out for me I don't like big fancy nails on myself but they want me to try them so I'm gonna try these Shaler picked these out and I think they're yeah they're glow in the dark they're Halloween nails and then Paisley picked these out. I thought they were really pretty. Um, some essential oils. I got clove because I'm going to try to make my own blend for fall. And then vanilla dream. Uh, let's see. They got some more wax melts. The farm apple and pumpkin. It smells so good. And then I picked these out for my Airwick plug-ins. The apple cinnamon medley. That's my favorite smell. We only have like the... Um, uno attack cards and they don't play like the regular uno cards so i got us a pack of uno cards to play gatorades for the rodeo the cats were out of dry food so i got them a bag of dry food Schaller is making pumpkins and stuff so she picked her out some more yarn hold on i'll find well here he is this is the little pumpkin that she did i thought it was cute so she's gonna make some more little crochet pumpkins uh, this is rodeo candy and daddy's candy for his little snack bag to for his birthday We wanted to put him a little snack bag together. So we got him the peanut M&M's likes peanut M&M's and then we got him the Hershey bars To go in there. They're kind of a little mushy because it's hot outside mm -hmm. Schaller picked out Reese's for the rodeo. We got gummy worms. We got a big bag of hot tamales a big bag of Skittles, and no, my kids will not be eating all this because we do share it. And let me get the big bag of peanut M&Ms. Mm -hmm. We got the big bag of peanut M&Ms for the rodeo too. Uh, I found the men's uh, Cheetos Munchies crackers. I cannot find the jalapeno ones again, so I don't know. I can't remember where I got them. I think I got them at Piggly Wiggly, so I may have to go back up there and find the men the jalapeno. Well, Caden, Caden and Sage like the jalapeno ones, mm -hmm. so Shaler likes them too. Oh, Shaler likes them too. Okay. Uh, did I, I got the orange and red yarn. That's Schaller's. And then um, three knee-high peach two liters for my husband to carry to work and a Millie Yellow two liter to carry to work. Uh, do you want to go hold the clothes up for me? All right. These shorts were on sale for $6, so I got me another pair of those. I have a black pair, and I absolutely love them. They're so comfortable. So, got me a pair of those. Okay. You can put them down and get the other stuff. And Sage picked out those bootcut leggings for herself or flare leg pants. It come in a two pack. It had the cheetah and then turn around. Let me see the peach. It's kind of like a peachy color. All right. Next. <laughs> and we got the black long sleeve shirt. We're trying to get a little bit of fall clothes here and there. Black long sleeve shirt to go with the cheetah pants. Okay, I'm let me put it down. No, the other one doesn't, it doesn't match that well with the cheetah ones. The black one does, though. And then I got her this kind of a oat color um, long sleeve shirt to go with the peach colored pants. Okay, you can put that one up there. And then Paisley didn't pick out too much today, so um, I let her go find. She likes hoodies for the winter time, and she needed some new hoodies because she's growing like a weed. So she got just kind of, it's almost like a bleached hoodie. There's it's just a black right hoodie. Here. And it's that comfortable material so that is everything i think oh and the mountain lightnings i got mountain lightnings to go to the rodeo too you keep from having to buy did i get what no i'm gonna get it next okay that's what we got from walmart next you're gonna see my um dollar tree haul we got tons of stuff at the dollar tree all right, y'all. Here is um, my Dollar Tree haul. I'm gonna go ahead and get the little ghosts because I just tired of holding them up. 
but they just have a little, they're like little witch ghosts. They have little eyeballs and a little hat, and then they have little long legs with boots on. They're boots. You're so they picked out two of those to decorate upstairs. <laughs> Steely. Steely's upset. Her mama went outside. Uh, we got some stuff to stick in the windows. So they got that one, and then I think they're going to put that one upstairs. Sage so picked out this little, like, little candle. I don't know how you put thing. it up there. Um, you have to stick this candle up there. Okay. Up through that. Make it light up. Yeah. And then they wanted a paint, so they picked out a few painting things. So it's I like a little scary house, and then here's it's like shiny. a little cauldron with a witch hanging out, or oh, there her was, feet hanging out of the top of it. There's the top up there too. Uh -huh. But Shelly's only got the feet. And then Paisley picked out these little miniature skeletons. I don't like Halloween. Halloween is just not for me. I'd rather do fall. So downstairs is just going to be fall. I told them they could decorate upstairs however they wanted to. So they wanted to do Halloween. So, um, but I can't remember who picked these little fall leaves lights out. Uh, did Paisley that? did. Paisley did. Mm -hmm. And then they got two little um, Halloween or little pumpkin ones. And then these are little owls, little Those LED string lights. And then I picked out these little corn. I thought they were so cute. They got like little beads on them. And then I think Charlotte picked out the spider. And then they got uh, two purple webs and a black web. Did y'all know these have like spiders in them? Yeah, they got little plastic spiders in them. See, so cool. Thought that was neat. And then, did you drop your candy? <laughs> and then they picked out um, some porcelain pumpkins to paint. So there's that pumpkin and then there's this pumpkin. Uh, I think that was, oh, no, so just coloring book. She got a little uh, Halloween coloring book, and then she picked out this little mermaid face mask. Oh, my goodness. A little mermaid face mask. Uh, we saw this essential oil, and it was, what was this flavor, Charlotte? Right there it is. French toast and pumpkin butter. It smells so good. And then I think Paisley, pa did Paisley pick this out? Yeah. Mm -hmm. A cosmic metallic peel off mask. They love face masks and stuff like that. So they got that. Oh, let's see if I skip anything. Uh, Caden needed some more electrical tape. Him and his girlfriend are making things for horses and they have to use electrical tape. So I got him four rolls of electrical tape. And then candy again. We got some Krabby Patties. Some circus peanuts, and then I got these to go in my husband's little goodie bag for his birthday. He absolutely loved these. They have cinnamon in them. They're cinnamon churro uh, salted nut rolls. So I got two of those. Uh, so I want a cotton candy. I forgot to get her cotton candy. I promised her the other day from the little event we went to. So we got some of that today. We got the regular cotton candy, and then we got the watermelon cotton candy. I needed some more like magic erasers, so we got two two packs of those. I was almost out of cotton balls. I use a lot of cotton balls for my wax melts. You just stick them in the top of your wax melts while the wax is hot, and it just sucks them up in there and you throw it away. Schaller is wanting to organize under their um, sink upstairs, so she needed some baskets to organize. So I got her three of the little clear baskets to organize under her sink. And that is all we got at the Dollar Tree. It was like $59, I think. Uh, seems like we're missing something from the Dollar Tree. Maybe we're not. Oh, yeah. My pumpkin and my thing. Go get it. I'm not touching it. It already got... Hold on. I'll just go over there. All right. I got this little um, glass... It's supposed to be like a tea light wax melt, but I was just going to use it for a little holder. And it got dropped and broken already, but Schaller glued it back together. And then I got this little green pumpkin. I thought it was cute. I haven't seen the green ones before. So, that's what I got. Okay, we just unloaded all these packages. The FedEx guy just dropped them off. We're here at the back door, so I got shoes everywhere. The cat is already looking for a box. Here's the rest of my Sam's order. I got two big things of the regular pine saw. I like it because it is a disinfectant. And then we got two of the 18 counts of Miami sausages. Those are just to stock my shelves just in case something bad goes wrong and we got something to eat. And Sage absolutely loves those. 
and then my paper towels came in and I think that was the last of everything that I had that I had ordered so all of my Sam's Club stuff is here okay y'all here is my meal plan for this week Sunday I'm planning on breakfast will be sausage cream cheese crescent bake I haven't made one in a little bit so thought I would do that we did something easy for lunch because we we're gonna be super busy the day before so I knew I wouldn't have time to like pre-cook stuff so we're gonna do hot dogs and chips Sage has been begging for chicken and dumplings I had them on my meal plan a couple of weeks ago but I kind of didn't cook them so I'm gonna do her some chicken and dumplings Monday which is my husband's birthday Breakfast will be homemade banana chocolate chip muffins. Lunch, I'll do ham and cheese sliders with some veggies. And then supper, I'm going to do pork chops, Hidden Valley potatoes, mac and cheese, green beans, and rolls. Um, I'm going to get my pork chops somewhere else because they were really expensive at Aldi and Walmart. So I'm going to run to my local grocery store. They have the best meat prices and the best meat in town. So I'm going to run to my local Piggly Wiggly and pick up the pork chops. Um, Tuesday, breakfast will be sausage gravy, eggs, and biscuits. Lunch will be chicken and mac and cheese. And then supper will be beans, cornbread, potatoes, and mac and cheese. Um, Wednesday, breakfast will be pancakes and bacon. Lunch will be pizza rolls and fries. And then supper will be tacos and rice. Thursday, breakfast will be baked oatmeal. That is a new recipe that I'm going to be trying. We hope it works. Lunch will be sandwiches and chips. And then supper is another new recipe, a Big Mac wrap. We're going to try it. Friday breakfast will be breakfast bowls, another new one. Lunch will be ham and cheese crescents. And supper is pizza and movie night. Somebody has spilled something all over my meal plan paper. I don't know what it is. Anyways. Saturday, a breakfast will be a big breakfast. Lunch will be quesadillas. And then supper, I'm going to do meatloaf, potatoes, mac and cheese, green beans, and jiffy muffins. Desserts this week, we're going to have brownies, cheesecake, cookies, cupcakes, a poke cake, pudding with whipped topping, and ice cream. Goodness, somebody just must have ate supper on my list on my meal plan this week. All right, y'all, that is my meal plan for this upcoming week. All right, y'all, that's gonna be it for my video today. Stay tuned for some upcoming videos. I'm planning on doing my house, getting my house cleaned up really well, and getting it decorated for fall. We are ready for some fall weather and some fall decorating, so stay tuned for that. I'm hoping I'll get it out, and I'll show y'all after I get it decorated. Uh, thank you so much for watching, and I will see y'all in my next one. Bye.